I've always had the idea that you have a bar that's like rock music in the main sort of area, and as soon as you walk into the toilet, it's disco. Here we go, we're going to make it bloody lovely. <laughs> hey! Oh, hey! Hey! And we're going to start off with two half lines. Squeeze. Two shots of vodka. <laughs> tequila. <laughs> and then we're going to use agave syrup. One shot of agave syrup. It's going to make it sweet. So people can just come and Hopefully. Drink, yeah. it, drink it out of a fake bar. And I've always wanted to open a bar. But we, we've been talking about sure it for a long time, but we don't yeah. know how to actually run a bar or <laughs> make drinks. <laughs> but we do know how to drink. It should work. Right. We can Why not? pull it up. Yeah, and if no one shows up, we'll just be at the bar. So, the idea of the pop-up bar came from when we were do, like making the record. Our producer Burke was like, oh yeah, like you can hear this song as like a backing track to a dive bar where you're just shooting pool and everyone's just hanging out and sort of drinking beers. So that kind of made us think, let's try and package the record as this kind of dive bar. We were listening to a lot of stuff like By The Strokes. You know, mid 2000s stuff, and that kind of inspired the, the dive bar. Plus, we love dive bars. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Flare it. <laughs> Yay! Best flaring I can do. Come on. Yeah. Be with you in a second. <laughs> okay, so then you get the fangs of steel. Cup, we can serve it. Put some ice in there first. <laughs> Bit of garnish. Bueno. Best one yet. There you have it. Good play. <laughs> Not too bad. Not too bad. Not too bad. Are you going to try some? <laughs> Feels like you're stalling. <laughs>